I'm Shirley Temple. And I'm Sandy Cruz. I'm speaking to you as chairman of the National Multiple Sclerosis Society's MS Hope Chest. I want to thank you for giving us a few minutes of your time to talk about chronic disabling multiple sclerosis. On our poster, we say, give hope. Let's look at the facts about this disease. More than 500,000 Americans are suffering from multiple sclerosis and related diseases. The impact of multiple sclerosis on the home life of its victims is tremendous, especially when the breadwinner is stricken. Every member of every MS family can tell you that home is where the hurt is when multiple sclerosis hits. Through the cooperation of the National MS Society, this is what I've learned. MS is a disease of the central nervous system for which no cause or cure is known. It attacks the myelin sheath, which is the protective covering or insulation of nerves. When patches of that sheath are damaged, the ability of the nerve to carry messages is impaired or destroyed. Some symptoms of MS are partial or complete paralysis of parts of the body, numbness of parts of the body, double or defective vision, speech difficulties, extreme weakness, and staggering and inability to keep one's balance. Although multiple sclerosis is usually a progressive disease, it does not develop according to any pattern. It strikes at random, and the order in which its symptoms appear varies from patient to patient, and the rate at which it progresses is equally variable. The problems MS brings with it, however, are much the same for all its victims. The most important one is how to live with MS. Fortunately, the MS patient no longer has to face this problem alone. Fifteen years ago, the National Multiple Sclerosis Society was formed to fight MS. MS chapters help support clinics and therapy centers where patients can receive individual treatment as prescribed by their own doctors. The goal is always to help the patient retain as much independence as possible. The MS chapters also try to help the families of the MS victims to the extent that their resources and those of the community permit. When possible, they send trained social workers to help the family adjust to its new problems. While our chapters bend every effort to ease the burdens of the patient and his or her family, our national society keeps working on the big basic problem of cause and cure. This lies in the future. How far away? We don't know, but one day it will be achieved through research. Your help is needed in many ways. We need you to help mail MS literature to assist MS patients in getting to and from their doctors and clinics. We need you to organize your community to raise funds for research projects, to help us with door-to-door -door canvassing. In other words, we need you to help wherever you can to fight multiple sclerosis. Let's deal a march on MS this year and make hope live for hundreds of thousands of MS patients. Please join your local MS chapter as a volunteer. May I count on your support? I'll be very happy and proud to work with you in this great cause. Believe me, you'll be glad you did. Thank you.